Divine One, Royals of the Three Kingdoms, welcome to Solm Palace. I'm Sephoria, the Queen of Solm. It's an honor to meet you, Queen Sephoria. And you. Really, it's a treat. And a surprise. I never expected Fogato to bring the Divine Dragon here. Out of everything he's done on his outings, this is the most impressive. I was just doing what any prince would do for his queen. That's mom to you. My son tries to act so cool, so detached. Anyway, those introductions when you arrived, there were a lot of them. First you, Divine One, and then the Firenese, Brodian, and Illusian royalty. Quite the guest list. I was so overwhelmed, I nearly fell off my throne. You have my apologies. We're here about a very important matter. Yes, you said. Fell Dragon Sombron's return. I had no idea all that was happening. And he created those creatures, hmm? That explains why they're so vicious. But your palace hasn't been attacked by the Corrupted? Or Illusion forces? Oh, it has. We got rid of them. I see. You got rid of them. Wait. Really? All of them? You seem surprised. I'm impressed. But certainly glad no one's breached the palace. I'm sorry to hear the other countries are having a harder time of it. And Queen Lomera. I visited her in Lethos many times. She was always very gracious. Naturally, the Queendom of Solm stands with you in your war against the Fell Dragon. Thank you. On that note, I have a request. The Ring of the Radiant Hero, which was entrusted to Solm. May I take it? Of course. I'll get it right away. Wait. Hmm. Where was it again? <sighs> I haven't seen it for a while. Fogato, do you know where the ring might be? No clue. Maybe it's in the doodad drawer? Hmm. Please, wait here a moment. Oh! Uh, okay. The doodad drawer. Has it been lying around in a musty cupboard this whole time? This is one of the strongest emblem rings. I... I don't know what to say. Ah, you know what? I just remembered. Tamara took it with her. Tamara? My sister. Also the crown princess. She's set to inherit my crown. And like Fogato, she's always out doing who knows what. To be fair, I acted the same when I was young. Anyway, she's been gone for days. Probably on a camping trip. Oh, that sounds great right now. So it's true. The crown princess and prince aren't around much. And she doesn't know when they'll be back. We can look for Princess Tamara. Do you have any idea where she might be? I think she was heading to the Southern Desert, in which case she'd set up camp in the Oasis. All right then, we'll head there. You know, a trip to the Oasis is just what I need. I'll pack my things. Yeah, actually, Mom, how about you stay put? Oh, all right. New kids go on without me. If you find Tamara, do summon the emblem, will you? I'd love to meet him. Be careful, it's already getting dark out. Come on, everyone. I'll lead the way. Mm. This meat is gonna hit the spot! I hope you're hungry for fun, cause that's what's on the menu first! <clears throat> And now, an exclusive performance from the one and only... Tamara! I'll be performing my favorite song with my backup singers, Marin and Panette. Ready. As am I. Hope you remember the words. And a one, and a two. Meat, meat, meaty meat, meat. What have we here? A bunch of pretty birds squawking away in the night? Ha! Cheap, cheap. Cheap, cheap is right. But there's nothing cheap about the ring that one has. Let's grab it. Meaty, meaty, ah uh, yeah. Meaty, meaty, uh, uh. Hey, hey, quit your con. Who 
are you two? Come on, wake up! What do you think? We're bandits! Bandits! And what do bandits do? Take stuff, like your fancy ring there. Give it! Oh! Oh? Uh, oh? That's all? You're in trouble. Really in it. Right now! In it and surrounded by it. We've got monsters. Big fans of ours. These two and way more. <gasps> so, we asked nicely, but you had to make us mad. Now, we'll do this our way. I saw a bonfire. That's gotta be her. What were those strange sounds? Tamara and her friends singing. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Don't worry about it. People call them the racket of Solm for a reason. Where did they stop? An attack, you think? Let's get over there and find out. Tamara! Oh, hey, Fagato. So, you're Princess Tamara. Nice to meet you. Don't tell me. You're the Divine Dragon, right? Fogato wouldn't have come here unless he found you first. He wouldn't have... what? Uh, not important. We've got bigger stakes to roast. Have to deal with these bandits for a start. It'd really help if you could use your summoning powers on this ring. The Ring of the Radiant Hero. I've always wanted to meet the person who lives in here. Can you make that happen? All right. Great! And a one, and a two. Fight on! Emblem of Radiance! Dang, those arms! You're ready to fight! I'm Ike. Make sure you use me wisely. Thanks for your help, Ike. You'll be fighting alongside Princess Tamara in this battle.
What's that? More? Those cheap, cheap birds must have gone con for help. Phooey! That's what I say. They won't beat our monsters. That's right. Not to mention our thieves. Experts in the art of ransackery. <laughs> They're gonna attack the village. We have to stop them before anybody gets hurt. Marin, Penet, come on! As you command, my princess. We'll crush them with the hammer of justice. Indeed, they shall sorely regret terrorizing these poor, innocent people. All right. I relish a taste. I'm ready. I love it. I hear you. I am ready to serve. Anything for you. The way forward is blocked, but not for long. Go, Tamara. With my strength, you'll have no problem opening up a path. What's that? The bandits? Oh, jeez. I'd rather you get a hold of this than they do. You think the village will loot itself? Get gone! Yeah, start at that house there. Let's go! <laughs> I must focus. Wouldn't miss it. I will not lose.
We'll get through this. Grant me strength.
a fine recipe. I'm your knight to command. Ready to order? What's our move?
that a rare critter? rough here. Steady. I'm honored.
emblem, engage! Ready for a fight! I must focus! Still in it! Nothing I hate worse than a meddler. You stuck your nose in our business, you'll pay. But of course. As you like. Wasn't much of a big brother, was I? Whatever you need. Ready for anything! Emblem! Engage! I will endure. The Oasis is ours, you hear? We've got exclusive plundering rights.
service. Yes, I let my brother down. Again. That takes care of that. Sorry for roping you into the scuffle, Divine One. That's all right. But I haven't had a chance to say why I'm here. I already explained this to Queen Sephoria and Prince Vagato, but... The Fell Dragon has been released. He's back. Hmm. It's sudden, I know. You're probably shocked. I already knew. You did? Mom and Fogato did too. We've all known for a while now. Fogato, you too? Sorry. Truth is, our chance meeting in Tula Desert wasn't totally by chance. Were you deceiving us? The opposite, actually. I had to make sure that you weren't deceiving us. When the Fell Dragon returned, we had to take steps to protect our country. I'll lay it out for you. The palace has scouts all over Elios, keeping an eye on the Three Kingdoms. When Elusia brought back the Fell Dragon, we learned about it early on. But we couldn't beat him without the emblem rings. And we couldn't use them without you. Our only option was to focus on defense. The Corrupted started appearing, so we had to quickly lay out a plan. And what was the plan? First off, Mom would stay in the palace. She'd work with the Royal Guard to keep out intruders. And we'd send out our militia, the Sentinels, to bolster soldiers' efforts against the Corrupted. As Captain... My job was to watch out for the Corrupted near the Illusion border. If someone claimed to be the Divine Dragon, I'd size him up and bring him to the palace. That's why you hid the fact you're a prince. I was in the Sentinels too, and I wandered the country keeping our ring safe. As part of this plan, did you ever consider asking for another country's help? No, because then we'd have to help them. We can't fight another country's battles. We're stretched thin fighting our own. That's how Solm does it. You scratch your own back, we'll scratch ours. Thank you very much. I see. I'm sorry we misled you, but we did it to protect the Queendom. I don't mean to criticize your country's way of doing things. I'm just surprised. Here's the most important part of the plan, though. If you did turn out to be the Divine Dragon, we'd give you the Ring of the Radiant Hero, and then tell you where to find our other emblem ring. Solm has a second ring? Yep, the ring of the crux of fate. It's in the... Your Highness, a message from Solm Palace. Huh? What is it? Hortensia, Princess of Elugia, has breached the palace. Oh. Oh. What? How did she get in? We have to save Mom. Let's go. Whoa! 
Indeed. I'm sorry. Amazing! Wow! Incredible. Hi there. Ah. Uh... Well then. Divine One, we discovered this mysterious bracelet in southern Firine. There appear to be more of them enshrined on the islands off the coast. We should investigate. There's an emblem inside this bracelet, all right. The presence inside is complicated, but I think I have the invocation. Lead us, emblem of rivals! Finally, we're free. I am Emblem Edelgard. Pleased to meet you. I am Emblem Dimitri. I guess that makes me Emblem Claude. Hi there. That must have been a crowded bracelet. Sorry, I should introduce myself. I'm the Divine Dragon. You're obviously not from Elios. May I ask what you're doing here? Until recently, we were the guardians of another world. It seems we were moved somehow. I get the feeling you've come to give me some sort of test. No need for that. You were able to summon us. That is enough. And your timing is excellent. We were just growing weary of each other's conversation. Speak for yourself. I thought Dimitri's stories were getting better with every telling. Yes, the sarcastic interruptions kept increasing too. Coincidence, I'm sure. You three all seem to be... really comfortable with each other. 
Appearances can be deceiving. Really, Edelgard? She's kidding. You can tell because her face looks exactly the same as when she's serious. <laughs> we have always been in competition. It will be refreshing to join forces. I should explain. We were all students at the Officers' Academy, but we led different houses. That's what you meant by competition. Yes. We only truly came together for special events, like the Battle of the Eagle and Lion. A traditional mock battle between the houses, to celebrate one another's strengths. The real celebration was afterward. Our festivities got rather exuberant that night. Dimitri looks pretty straight-laced, but don't let him fool you. Between you and me, he's like a force of destruction at a party. I'm surprised they didn't expel his whole house for those shenanigans. <laughs> Must have been quite a night. You only just met him, so you can't tell if he's joking. Just ignore half of everything he says. Come on, be fair. At least a third of what I say is worth hearing. You do know a third is less than half, right? Let me say it formally. Our power is at your disposal. Please make the most of it. Victory will be ours. Have no fear. We are here to help. And if these two and their conventional tactics fail, maybe I'll show you a few tricks. That's all very reassuring. Thank you. I'll do my best to help the three of you work together. then. Thanks for shopping. Feel free to come again. Yes. Be. How hard do you want to go? 
What'll it be? How hard do you want to go? What'll it be? How hard do you want to go? Perfect! You've got this! Perfect! You've got this! Looking good. You've got this. Looking good. You've got this. Perfect. You've got this. Looking good. I'm so proud. Let's do this again sometime. Okay, just leave it to me. These expensive ingredients make me so nervous. <sighs> I didn't waste a single scrap of food. Thanks. Thanks. Here, I made you a to-go meal. Hope you like it. Messina, let's go! Guard. Indeed. That's true. Right.
Thank you. 